Alright my slams, welcome back to another GTA 5 LSPD Fire Patrol on the PC. Today we're playing as the Met Police's Violent Crime Task Force. We're going to be responding to some serious crime. Currently we've got an issue with the M&S store across the uh, block. We're going to be responding there. Apparently there's an armed gang. Hey Control, show Spider th uh, 613 responding high grade to that. Uh, I believe it's armed robbery by a local gang masquerading as clowns. Using caution, not sure if firearms are involved just yet. Responding high grade should be there shortly. We need some available units. State 6 on scene. Yeah, I got two mosepeds just moving off from the uh, MS store. Uh, I believe they're driving at uh, they're driving at high speeds, but they're getting through traffic quite quickly. We're on Power Street right now. We need some available units. Uh, Spider 613, we're going to need some air support as well. We've got two mopeds are splitting up. Splitting up. One's gone left on Carson Avenue. The other one's continuing Chamberlain Hills. I'm going to get the other units go after the uh, one of Chamberlain Hills. Go to Carson Drive. Visual, visual, suspects coming up, forum drive. Got the VCTF units coming in. Uh, one of them is going northbound, I believe it's going uh, westbound, eastbound, sorry. And the other one is going towards Wembley Stadium. Okay, the other unit, the other vehicle is going towards Grove Street. He's now past the BP garage. Okay. We've got the second moped, it's going to be going towards Wembley Stadium, uh, Spider 613 is currently in pursuit. Road traffic conditions are going to be light, speed is going to be about 5-0, I don't think it's going to go very fast in this vehicle. I'm going to wait for another Spider unit before we can uh, perform some tactical maneuvers going towards the airport. Spider 613 update, Dutch London Street, just going, leaving the airport now, is going towards town. Uh, the moped is continuing, we've got two... Uh, Passenger, we've got a passenger driver basically dressed up as like clowns. One's wearing a green jacket, the other one's wearing red polka dots, I believe. It's on South Arsenal Street now. We've got two units in pursuit. Stand by, we've got one spider unit, one regular unit. We're going to be performing maneuver on this uh, vehicle shortly once the traffic clears up. Currently in the section, gone past the red ATS. Okay, this is Spolevard coming to the T section. We'll be performing evasive maneuver shortly. Got another spider unit coming up. Galera Ceremony, go past another intersection. So Vespucci Boulevard. Traffic conditions are currently low. Performing evasive and performing a um, tactical maneuver with a vehicle. Stand by. Go, go, go! Put your hands up. On the ground now. On the ground. Taste deployed, taste deployed, Clear Avenue. Put your hands where I can see him. Get on the freaking ground now. One at red dot, taser point. Second suspect is on foot, fleeing at this point in time. Stop pissing about. Get your hands on the ground, okay? I'm going to tase you again. And so I can see him. On the ground, keep your hands so I can see him. Okay, this guy's knocked down. Let's see if I can put him down. Guys, we need to go after the second clown. Spider 613 looking for the second suspect on foot. I believe the first one gave us a bit of hassle. Where is the second guy? Come on. Freaking clowning around. His friend was being trying to be such a pest for me when I was trying to arrest him that it was impossible. 
I'm trying to go into the um, I'm gonna go into the car park to the lights off, see if we can surprise him there if he's running here. I feel like he's running here. Keep my lights on. The other unit's searching for him too. I believe that's another unit. Is he? Is that? Hang on a sec. Who's driving that police car? Because it's not coming up on my marker as a police unit. Alright, mate. You good? Oh, okay. He's just go back to the station because his vehicle's damaged. Okay, we'll go check the other side. Apparently, you can't find the guy with the red polka dots. We're going to reroute ourselves to the uh, second moped, though. Uh, control from Spider 613. We're going to be rerouting ourselves to the uh, second vehicle fleeing. Currently at Palomino Avenue. We're heading there, I grade now. Currently got one unit and a helicopter pursuit. Be advised, uh, other units in this area, Vespucci Boulevard area, the wide search area, we've got a clown with wearing a red polka dot clothing, he's been escaped from the uh, moped, basically he was the driver I believe, and he's uh, got a weapon on him, involved with violent crime, reference to be the MS that's just been recently robbed. Spider 613 is looking for the second vehicle, we've got local units looking for that guy. Just about one minute out, Carson Avenue going up forward drive, we'll make visual with the second vehicle now. Get out of the way! Where's your problem? Joining the pursuit at Autopia Park, we will be taking a lead from here if there's not a traffic unit in the pursuit. Stand by for more information. I'm currently in Dutch London Street, making our way up. He's going towards the uh, dual carriageway. Yeah, we got another pursuit unit. I'll be just taking behind them. Spider Six One Three will be taking lead pursuit from here. Visual on the moped, two uh, occupants, it's going to be a driver and a passenger, one's wearing a purple jacket, the other one's wearing a green suit, a jumpsuit I believe. It's on Davis Avenue now. Spider 613, we need a marked unit here for uh, tactical purposes. We'll try and knock them off the vehicle, but I believe we need a marked unit to do that, unless they're going to be shooting at us or throwing stuff at us. It's going to be Greenwich Parkway coming towards the town again, just coming from the airport. Spider 613, we'll be making a tactical contact with the vehicle shortly, Calais Avenue, once he gets past this uh, intersection. Road has clear, go, go, go! Bloody hell, guys. Hands where I can see him. Right, keep your hands where I can see him. Okay, we got this fellow arrested and in custody. And the control for Spider 613, but he've got the suspect in custody, the second suspect has already been taken to the station, and we've got this, uh, the, uh, I believe it's the passenger has been, uh, in our custody now as well. Alright, you stay there, mate. Alright, let's get some ID. Right, uh, Needle Dick, you go search him, I'm gonna go search the bike, see if there's any compartments. Fagio. I tried putting in some real mopeds in-game, but looks like it didn't really work. So we got fedora, shovel, you know, the stuff, and apparently we got fentanyl, and we also got a small revolver, which is going to be quite interesting. Alright, at this point in time, Mr. Lee, you're being placed under arrest, and I don't want any funny business from you. You don't have to say anything, but it may harm your defense. If you fail to mention something, should they allow any call? Anything you do say, you're giving an evidence. Do you understand? 
Where are you going? Oh, he's going to go take him to the station. Okay. Right, yeah, you officers can take him to the station if you're comfortable with it. We'll go and pound the bike. Alright, so you got... This, my friends, is a very interesting patrol. This thing I haven't actually done, so... In case you guys are wondering, so now I've got all the, um, you know, all that uh, call out Wallachia out of the way. Basically, the Violent Crime Task Force is an elite unit in the Met that I think was formed a couple of years ago. Now, you remember... I hate mentioning this because it's horrible, but if you remember a few years ago, there was a terrible rise in acid attacks and violent crime around London, especially moped gangs. Around 2016, 2015, police couldn't really follow mopeds. They weren't allowed to because if they took the helmets off, then it'd be a risk to the public. That all changed. And the Met Police started cracking down. They started using some really nasty tactics to take these horrible people off the road. So at this point, because of the amount of crimes that these guys do and the horrible things that they do, you know, it kind of warrants the police being quite tough on them. So they like they'll knock them off the bike, or you know, grab them by the by the um, basically put them in chokeholds, grab them, smash them to the floor, and then lock them up in a van or something. You know, what type of stuff? They'll be rough handling these suspects because these people are basically ruthless. And a lot of the crimes they do is to basically impress the gangs that they're in type of thing. I'm just going to grab some snacks over here. Alright there mate, how's it going? I, I nicked you the other day. I didn't nick you, but... Are you still got the feet pics on your computer? No? He doesn't want to speak to me. I thought I'd blame him. It was a bit of an arsehole last time, to be fair. But yeah, the VCTF, um, if you noticed that there's actually a slight decrease in crimes because these tactics are actually working. That's the thing. It's actually very impressive what they've done. They've actually restructured part of the force and made a special kind of unit that, you know, drives unmarked vehicles or high-performance vehicles, has special training, basically put in strategic positions all around London and their local boroughs. I think it's pan London, so that means throughout all the boroughs, really. And you've got traffic officers, you've got response officers like us, you know, you've got all sorts of officers that are going to be contributing in this unit with their own expertise and I think a lot of the officers are quite experienced so it's not just like new bobbies or anything there's going to be people that have been on the force for quite a few years they know how the um, they know local ins and outs of the borough they know how the crime operates in that local area type of thing so uh, we're playing as these guys today which is really cool i got to say I think beforehand they wouldn't have actually you know they wouldn't know how to tackle these crimes because you know you get traffic units involved and then they couldn't really follow mopeds and stuff and then you get regular units and they haven't got like high powered vehicles to follow them. I think a lot of it would have been done by the armed response units back in the day but obviously because of terrorism you want the armed response units to kind of be freed up. So you don't want them doing like you know all the donkey work of the regular units that we could be doing for instance in this game. Alright we'll be patrolling this neighborhood here before we get more information about any situation regarding that incident. I think that incident's closed. So the clown's pretty much been arrested. And we're going to go just drive up this area. Because it's actually quite a strategic location. You wouldn't really expect police cars down here. You'd expect them in the city area. So we're going to go to this residential area just wait for calls. Met Control, uh, Metro Alpha 613 Spider Unit is going to be available in Invention Close, I believe. Invention, invention court, sorry. Uh, yeah, we're available for calls. We're just standing by at this point in time, waiting for any uh, assistance from other units. So, I'm going to show you this nice vehicle. I think I found it on Union Mods. It's a lovely car that's basically used by the Met Police. This is a Met Spec unmarked vehicle. You can download it, I think. I've got a link to it. I might put a link up. If I can't, then I'm not sure. But I want to show you some of the equipment. So some of you guys are going to roll your eyes right now. Same equipment you always see. But if the new viewers, you got to give them a chance. So you look at my character right now. Fire buzzers, peds, just in case you wonder where they're from. Got the uh, taser on me, as well as the spray. So, like always, we're going to be using the spray if we have to. Like that, see? But also we got the taser for all the violent crime suspects. So when they got mopeds or they're kind of like, you know, they got weapons, then we we'll use a taser. And uh, needle has got a taser as well, so he's always got my back. So we've got the usual weapons on us, but we've also got, you know, the taser. I thought all the Met officers had tasers, because whenever I see them, they usually always carry tasers. But it turns out it's just a select few, like the ones in the VCTF units. But uh, apart from that, they are going to arm them with more tasers. We're just going to go on dispatch right now and see if there's any more incidents that we can assist with. And I say assist because we are a specialist unit. Okay, so we currently got intelligence that there is a drug deal in Pillbox Hill. It's going to be around this area. And they may be armed with melee weapons. We're going to try and head there quickly. And then we'll proactively try and stop it. 
Apparently they just started it, person's counting the money, it type of thing. We were literally around the corner. Show Spider 613 spotting eye grade to that drug deal at Pellbox Hill. I do not know where my motion blur went. For some reason, sometimes it goes on and off. Spider 613 is going to be in location. But some of you guys don't like the motion blur anyway, so I guess it's a hit and miss. Let's drive around here. It's a bit laggy as well, isn't it? Kind of bothering me. Let's see if I go to the menu. But anyway, we're in position just around... Ah, oh, okay, it's the car park. Right, there's always dodgy stuff that happens here. Uh, Spider 613, yep, they've been alert as a presence. We've got two suspects running away. We've got an elderly woman, I believe it's an IC3 male with a hood. We're going to request available local units in a hurry up. I'm going to try and go for the dealer. I don't want to stereotype here, but I feel like the youth with the hoodie on is going to be the one dealing the drugs. We're going to get the borough units on to this woman. Oh, okay, there we go. This is it. Yep, this is it. VCTF to the rescue. Patrol from uh, Spider 613 Elgin Avenue. We've got a vehicle pursuit. The uh, male hooded drug dealer, I believe, is just made off. He's just uh, jacked someone's Mercedes. It's going in takeoff ways. The Mercedes E Series is currently driving on the motorway. Pursuit conducted. I believe he's slowing down, but the registration plate is going to be Lima Tango 64 Alpha Hotel Whiskey. Vehicle's going to be going about 560 uh, in a uh, 50, I believe. Risk is going to be medium at this point in time. Traffic density is low. Pedestrians are not uh, present in this area. Advanced vehicle, t pack train, but we are currently covert vehicles. So you need some marked units. Going on Los Santos Freeway now. Okay, he's going up 80 miles per hour. He's trying to escape the city. We've got one spider unit, myself in pursuit. We need some more units over here as well. We have permission for pursuit conducted as of uh, half past seven in the evening in state one. With spider 613, we can get some other units in pursuit as well. He's going towards the slip road, and now he's going back on the motorway. He's going northbound in State 1. We've currently got M-Pass in the air. Spider 613 is under State 1 now. He's just going past the turn off of Sonora Way. It's a silver Mercedes E-Series. Lima Tango 64 Alpha Hotel Whiskey. Uh, it's going to be a hooded male driving the vehicle. I believe he's a drug dealer connected to that crime. At this point in time, we're just following the vehicle, but we need some units over here. We're going to try and stop him before he leaves our uh, jurisdiction. Backup needed on Los Santos Freeway. Copy dispatch. Vehicle's going route one three, route one three. We currently got two other units to catch up to the pursuit. I believe he's slowing down. I think he's running out of fuel. Spider 613 will be performing tactical maneuver just past the slip road. Stand by. It'll be strike, strike, strike. Go, go, go! Spider 613 and other available units. We're going to be using all means necessary to stop this vehicle before we head to the intersection. Route 13, we've got, currently got two, three traffic units in pursuit. We'll just be stopping this uh, fellow now on the motorway. We just made contact with him. Stand by for takedown.
Strike, strike, strike. Get out of the car now. Get out. Get out. Top of your hands. On the ground now. On the freaking ground. Six one three. We got the suspect uh, on Union Road. Road just apprehended. We can close that. Uh, close this road off. Close this first two lanes. Right, go over here. Go over here. I'm trying to think funny with me. Okay, got a lockpick. Uh, nothing on him, okay. Alright, let's go get him down. Let's get a transport for him. Okay, Mr. Benitez, as of this point in time, you're placed into arrest for violent, uh, drug deal and violent carjacking with intent to escape police custody. You don't have to say anything, but it may help me defense if you fail to mention something you should later learn in court. Anything you do, so you've never understand. Oh, that bloody siren to shut up. I have to delete the car, actually. Otherwise, it won't go away. <laughs> kind of annoying, but it's part of the game. All right, let's wait for this, uh, van to come. We've got a special unit coming over here. Oh my gosh. This fan is taking forever, man. Get over here. Idiot. Alright, he's over here, guys. We got the vehicle to um, clean up as well. 613, we need some RTPC units over here. Gonna get a rig. Oh, I can't even get the regular traffic unit because the script's crashed. It doesn't matter. We had a good patrol. Okay, we had a good patrol, guys. I'm not, I don't care about this at this point. But anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. I absolutely love playing as the uh, VCTF. Not gonna lie, that was a really fun patrol. Probably quite a few inaccuracies compared to real life, but uh, as far as you go with the mods we have, this is the best we got. I mean, I know in real life they have the VF, or I think it's VC, like Venice or something, epaulets on the, sh on the uh, stab vest. We've got SW, the regular borough units here. And also in real life they have like special kind of tactical stab vests. So uh, apart from that, Sometimes they carry on like wear on mark clothing as well. But apart from that, pretty good patrol. Hope you folks enjoyed that. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys in another video. Still then, stay tuned.